Hillary Clinton will be in Southern California today after her victory in the Nevada caucus. Donald Trump is also enjoying his victory in South Carolina. Kate Taylor's Eric Spillman. tribute honoring legendary director James Burroughs aired last night. Take a look at how the cast of Friends incorporated their missing cast member. Forced and it was too short, but it wasn't meant to be a reunion. It was meant to honor the director. James Burroughs. So. No idea. Uh, 527 is the time. Coming up, some serious sand erosion at our local beaches. A manhunt is underway in a deadly road rage stabbing in Silver Lake. Police found the 20. A Florida woman was severely beaten, allegedly by a roommate that she found on Craigslist. As a warning to viewers, some may find this video disturbing. 23 year old Danielle Jones remains in a coma seven days after being attacked. The victim. Now he wants $30 million to reopen the road. Tech GPS has found its way into a lot of gadgets, and now parents are turning to the technology to keep track of their kids. Play wants to take five to take care of you with some free cash. been playing the scratch off lottery for years without winning much until they hit the six million dollar jackpot. Well, it is now open. We're also learning that another plant closure scheduled for this week won't be needed after all. KTLA's Mark Vester, live in Corona. Director with James Comey is speaking out against Apple's decision to fight the court order to unlock the an iPhone belonging to one of the San Bernardino shooters in a blonde. All right, Henry, thank you. 612 is the time still ahead. A walk in memory of a one year old girl. Ginger, thank you. Still ahead, breaking news and a disturbing discovery why a popular hiking trail is off limits this morning. Your baby girl is being remembered after she was hit in the head with a bullet while she was in her crib. The Compton community CHP is trying to track down motorists who are pulling off dangerous stunts on the San Francisco Bay Bridge. If you need one more reason to pick a cup of Joe this morning, scientists now say coffee can undo liver damage. All right, this Friday you can celebrate Brazilian Carnival right here in Los Angeles.